FYZ4K here, welcome back to another one. Hope you guys are doing well. Today we got a tutorial for you in Adobe Photoshop. So, usually when I come up with ideas for tutorials is when I get stumped with something and then I find the solution and then I get this brilliant idea to share with you guys. So, today we're gonna to be talking about how to remove lens flares in Adobe Photoshop. So lens flares at times is an art, is, is a talent, is a technique to add into pictures and usually clients like lens flares, okay? However, there comes a time when you are shooting a condo or a house and you have this lens flare at the bottom corner or at the top corner somewhere that really messes things up. So. Today I'm gonna to show you how to remove it in about, I'd say, a minute. It's pretty quick, pretty easy, um, and it could be used for any other type of objects that you wanna remove as well, not just lens flares. So let's get into it, let's dive into it, let's have some fun. Here we go. So I pulled up a picture of a condominium that I shot for a real estate agent. The 12 by 24 gives fantastic lens flares. However, it could be a slight pain when you're looking to not have these lens flares in the picture. So for this example, we are going to start off with selecting the, the lasso tool and we are going to outline the area that has the lens flare. Okay. Once you have that selected, you're gonna right click and you are gonna choose the fill and you're gonna make sure content aware is selected, okay? You have quite a few different options here. Make sure content aware is selected. Hit okay. And there you have it. And what we can do is we can go ahead and try to remove the next one. Right over here. Again, we will click fill. All right, pretty good. It's a lot quicker than actually going in and cloning the image and trying to figure out the best place to clone from. It's definitely a lot better, a lot, lot better. So let's just zoom back out. Okay, we got a few more here around the tree area. Okay, we'll just go into this little area over here. Not bad. So if we were to compare this picture with the original, take a look at that. I'm just gonna go back and forth. A lot better and done real quick. You don't have to redo the shoot. You don't have to go back to the location and try to attempt to redo the shoot because now you've cleaned it up almost perfect. It's almost 100%. 
I mean, we see where we've done it because we've gone through it. But if you were to look at this picture from scratch, from the get-go, from the beginning, it may be a little hard to tell what you've done to it. It looks perfect. All right, and that is it. That is how you remove a lens flare or any other object in that matter in about a minute or two. Quick and easy, I hope you guys enjoy this. I figured that this was a very good example. This will help you guys with assignments, projects, things that may come up now or in the near future. So if you guys enjoyed this one, do remember to smash that subscribe button. It's gonna be down there. And we'll catch you guys on the next one. Till next time, take care of yourselves.